Welcome. Take a seat, get comfortable, and get ready for your journey. Try to sit upright and keep your legs uncrossed. For best results, place your Kinect sensor in a central position, above or below your TV. You may need to sit forward in your seat if it has high arms, a low seat, or a soft back. Make sure you have enough room to play. Try not to sit too close to other people or objects. To access the Connect guide while playing, hold your left arm straight out to your side. Try this now to begin your journey. Okay, <laughs> everyone, it's Mendez here playing Fable the Journey. So I actually play this sitting down? Huh. I did not expect that. <laughs> oh, man. Um, I'm wondering if it's worth... Okay, give me a second, guys. Okay, that should sound slightly better. I have basically... Since I would basically be sitting here for the entire time, I guess I could set up a natural permanent microphone stand. So there we go. Hey everyone, it's me that's here playing some Fable the Journey. I was not expecting to actually be sitting down while playing this game. <laughs> it's like, it's a Kinect game! <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> Pretty much recording this straight after um, Harry Potter Kinect, so actually I'm kind of glad to not be jumping around, but still. Oh no, Kinect ID failed, oh no! Well, I can tell you for a fact, Mr. Game, that my name is Mindesi, and I am an Xbox Live subscriber, and my profile is indeed on my uh, hard disk drive, and the Xbox uh, Live terms of use have changed since when? I have no idea. Oh boy, am I going to have to cut this out? Fantastic, that's going to be fantastic. See you in a second, guys. Okay, got slightly further than I did before. Hey <laughs> everyone, it's Mindesi here playing some... Uh, Fable the Journey! That was weird, because, you know, I play on my 360 quite a bit, so I don't know why it said the terms of conditions have been updated, because they haven't. But yeah, anyway, let's start the game. This should be fun. This icon indicates your game is being saved. Do not turn off your console. Do not change anything. Do not press control or delete. Do not... Just do not. Even the grace of journeys must begin with a single step. How am I supposed to take a step when you've told me to sit down? Think it through, game. Think it through. <laughs> so what I really know about this is an on-rails RPG type thing, and uh, that's basically all I do, so there you go. I've not played any of the three previous Fable games, but I don't think that's going to be a hindrance towards this game because it's entirely different in its scope. Uh, 50, 60. Come on, keep the pace up. We've got a long way to go before we get home. Morning, Catlin. Thunder, weather's holding up. Should make good time today. Daniel, I've seen Gabriel this morning. Uh, you said my name. name. Damn it, Gabriel. Where are you? No, I'm not Gabriel. So, uh, okay. This is interesting. <laughs> Am I meant to be doing something? It's just told me to sit down and be quiet. Okay. <laughs> Random oh, horse brushing scene. Come on, come on, come on, go, go, come on, let's go. Come on, Saren. What do you think, Saren? Come on, I'm getting better. 
I'm ready for whatever we run into. Bumpy roads, bit of drizzle. Your mail? Stuff of legends. Okay. Come on, girl. <laughs> So, uh, at what point do I do something in this game? Maybe now? Maybe now! Uh, the convoy will be moving on soon. We better get you ready. Oh, I'm gonna brush it. Oh, this is like connectimals! <laughs> hey, everyone, it's been this here playing some uh, There's a good girl, connectimals, horse adventures. Oh, I can brush with both hands. Yeah, I'm brushing the horse as fast as I can! This is the best way to win a horse infection. There you are, Gabriel. Catelyn, I thought you were getting the convoy ready. You and that old mare are holding everyone up again. You mean the tribe's already left? But what were you doing? Were you distracted by the butterflies? Or were you just daydreaming about old fables? No, I was just about to get Severin ready. Look, I'm not letting you out of my sight until I know you can keep up. But this is the last time I come back for you. Absolutely, it won't happen again. Now get Severin harnessed up and let's get moving. All right, I just need to get me Now, up. Gabriel! Okay, I'll, I'll do a thing. I guess we're going horse riding. Yay! Oh, no, we're not. We're just kind of attaching it to Come the. On, Gabriel, the convoy will be miles away by now. All right, all right, I'm coming. Come on. Keep your moustache on. Am I gonna have to ride this? I'm gonna have to ride this. This is gonna be fun. I get to whip a horse. This is what I've wanted to do all my life. Come on. We've got a lot of catching up to do. Like, whip, whip the horse. We'll be well on their way by now. Can I whip a horse? Track the reins once to make Saren trot. Once trotting, you can accelerate to a gallop by cracking the reins a second time. So what you're telling me is that I can actually whip a horse. Whip a horse! Whip a horse! What okay, so like I can speed you up. Anyway? Why is this appeared? <laughs> what did I do to make this appear? I have no Nothing. okay. Yeah. And so you'd have done that all day and come back. Whip the horse! I can't always be there looking out for you. And I can drop my hands if I want to rest my arms. <laughs> steer right, pull the right rein towards your body and push the left rein away. To steer left, pull the left rein towards your body and push the right rein away. While steering, try to keep your hands low and make large, clear movements. Okay. I gotta say, I'm liking the uh, tutorial, it's very clear. Oh wow, I actually like, I get control over where I'm going, like, kind of. Not really, but like, kind of. It kinda, you know? I can move left and right. <laughs> That's the important thing. You know, let, let's lower my hands. Just gotta, I need to rest my arms. It's been, it's so strenuous, making this horse uh, run around and stuff. So I guess we're just stealing around obstacles for now. I don't really know what I was expecting, but it wasn't this. I don't know why. <laughs> when are you going to fix up this old cart, Gabriel? Soon. My cart does not need fixing. My cart is perfect. Busy sure. fighting imaginary trolls and balverines more. Go left. Oh, keep hands low. Okay. Keep hands low. All right. I gotta say the the recognition on this is pretty um, okay. <laughs> Maybe it's just because I've not really played many Kinect games since the first batch that were released with the Kinect. So uh, I don't really know how good it's gotten, but it seems it seemed pretty good from what I've seen from Dragon Ball Connect and this game. I'm not gonna even I'm not gonna really mention Harry Potter because that wasn't that great, but Road's about this game seems rough. pretty good. Careful you don't make Saren run over any rocks. Let's keep it slow through here, nice and easy. Yeah, woe betide we run over any rocks. Gently pull the reins to your chest to lower your speed. Rough terrain will injure Saren unless ridden over at a trot. Your cart won't get far without a horse, so make sure you take good care of her. Or, I could whip a horse. That's my strategy. Easy now. Slow Come down, me. Gabriel. There we go, there we there go. Come go. on, let's go slow. Why can't you drive like this all the time? Because speed is of That's the essence. Saren may be old, but there's still a few miles left in the old girl. Don't listen to him, girl. Off the rocks he yet? just wishes he had a horse like you. Yeah, right. Onwards! Be it. <laughs> this is pretty interesting. Oh, God. Onwards, onwards. There we go. Onwards! I'm not pulling the thing in. Turn left! Turn left! God's sake. Okay, slow down, slow down, slow down. There we go. Okay, this is basic cart control. I don't know how much cart control is going to be in the game. This is kind of odd. <laughs> 
I think so far there's only been like one way we can go though, so that's okay. I don't know if my horse has any kind you of think health these bar. Are dangerous. Wait till we get to the course. You mess up. You and Seren are going for a swim. That sounds like fun actually, but I've not been for a swim in ages. Just so I know I don't have to worry about you when we get there. Um, no, heavy stop this I don't know how to stop. Quickly, pull the reins back high over your head. Okay. Good plan. So, I can do that. And then we stop! Right. Oh man! I feel better now. Now let's get moving. Catch up to the convoy. What is going on with that rain? I don't even know. It's just with a horse. And onwards we go. I am enjoying the whole uh, horse whipping simulator 2012. It's pretty cool. So, uh, I guess we're just kind of looking out. This is just like driving, <laughs> in a way, kind of. Not really, but you know. You know what I mean. It's kind of, it's kind of um, not really what I was expecting. Boy, those were rocks. Those didn't look like rocks to me. I am so going to get my horse killed. I can tell that right away. Like, don't expect this horse to live for more than, like, one part of the game or anything. Okay, so now my horse has health. She didn't before, but now she does, so um, I might want to actually consider, actually, maybe, uh... As you travel, you'll come across experience orbs on the road. Collecting these will allow you to purchase upgrades. Green orbs can be collected at any speed, but other colors require specific speeds. Okay, that's fine, I guess. So we gotta... Let, let, wait, 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 let, let's slow down, let's slow down, let's slow down, okay. Let's slow down because I know if I don't then I'll miss them and you can't really turn around in this game so I, I, I kind of want to get the experience. So I'm going to drive like an old woman for a little while but that's okay. Driving like an old woman. There's someone fishing over there. That's pretty cool. I'd like to go join him actually. It's like a little bit more relaxing over there. Reaver's Reach Bridge, then on to Shalefield to set up the summer camp. The going's good. We should be there in less than a day. Turn left, damn it. Where does the time go? Seems like only yesterday we were running through the fields, play fighting with sticks, not care in the world. Sometimes I miss those days. Things were simpler then. Okay. <laughs> oh no 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 not not rocks no actually they, that didn't even hurt you at all. You're a good horse. You can you can survive a few rocks. You're, you're good. Don't worry about it. You're 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 a good. You're a pretty good horse. You were raised by me, clearly you must be at least skillful, um, skillful at something, and that is what why I'm quite happy to let you run over some rocks every now and then. Albion Way! I have no idea where we're going, but like, fortunately there's only been one road so far, so, uh, yeah. <laughs> um, I could drop my hands if I wanted to. Oh no! I'm losing health! Poor Epona, or Seren, or whatever your name is. do 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 do, gonna grab that, gonna grab that, gonna grab that, and we're getting some experience. Look there on just the horizon, kind of rolling. Power stone, or bricks and smoke. Why would anyone live in a place like that when they could have the open road, eh? Uh, well, there are a myriad of reasons. Uh, firstly, being convenience of facilities, uh, another being um, social interaction. Uh, there's also uh, more job security because you know um, I imagine there's some kind of infrastructure over there where um, whereby there will be some kind of global economy and things like that. You know, there's a lot of reasons for living in a city rather than the countryside. So I'd, I'd really get off your high horse and uh, shut it's up. A storm basically. brewing. See, there above the spire. Maybe it's coming from the spire. That tower is magical, you know. I read it nearly ended the world once. I'm guessing this is a reference to a previous game. Whoa. Maybe. Oh, my reins! Come on, I want to whip that horse. It's heading this way. I need to ride ahead now. We'll be at Reaver's Reach soon. I have to make sure the tribe's together when we cross. Okay. Make sure you keep up the pace. All right. No, screw you. I should go as slow as I want. Even faster. While galloping, crack the reins once to make Saren sprint. Each time you crack the reins to make Saren sprint, you'll use up some of her stamina. If the stamina bar in the bottom center empties, continuing to crack the reins will injure Saren. Take a break from sprinting and the bar will recharge. Ooh! 
this sounds kind of interesting. Cool. So I'm guessing that the red experience is also going to go while sprinting. You ready, girl? Okay, so crack, okay, go, and then crack again, and then crack again. You want to turn left, turn left, turn left, turn left, turn left, God damn it, turn left. God damn it, we retarded horse. Come on, turn, turn, go, come on, go, go, come on, come on. Come on. Here we go, here we go. I don't really want to sprint while we're, you know, at such dangerous cliffs and stuff. Shalefields. Perhaps I am we'll being a little bit we'll be across the river I am cautious in this, but you know. Lying in the long grass, looking up the clouds, not caring the world. Turn, turn left, turn left, goddammit. Sometimes Saren does not seem to want to turn. I think, yeah. Because this game is very on rails, it's um, a little bit difficult to um, actually steer, because the steer is kind of auto lock on. Which is a little unfortunate and is messing with my brain. <laughs> which is not good. Come one, come all. Peer into your future. Gaze at the glimmer of your destiny. Glowing circles show optional side areas to explore. If you want to take a break from your journey, just slow down or stop within the circle to see where it leads. Okay, I'm guessing these are like side quests then. We can check one of these out. Come on, stop, 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 stop. Oh yeah, I need to do that. That's right. Welcome to my theater of fate, sir. They call me Benny the Magnificent. Although everyone else calls me Jeffrey. What? Hi, Jeffrey. Wait, do not speak. For Benny I seek the, the Holy Grail. Knows all things. <sighs> ah, yes. I see it now. Oh. I seek that chicken what over there. What you seek is... That chicken. For me to wallpaper your dining room a week next Thursday? Uh, maybe you could just tell me my future? Do I have to cross your palm with silver? What? Silver? Oh, did, did, yes, that's right. Silver. You must cross my palm with silver. I don't have any silver. Well, why <laughs> didn't you say that in the first place? You've really not got the hang of this, have you? Oh, not really. I'm not very good at, bar at bargaining. Why, yes, it's coming to me now. With the moon and stars high up in the heavens, the night may not be as dark as usual. A stranger could appear. Or perhaps a friend, colleague, family member, or some other living thing. And say something to you using words you may not be able to hear. Words? That's terrifying. Lower your hands, I'm sorry. Such this game wants me to sit very still. Now go, safe in the knowledge of foresight. For Benny the Magnificent knows all things. And now farewell, for the pathway of my destiny draws me to a new plane of existence. I like that guy. <laughs> Give, give me a chicken. I want your chicken. I still want your chicken. Now you're just gonna. Are we done here? You're just gonna sidestep off, just kind of. Yeah, no, I'm just shuffling off. Let's go. Every, every day shuffling. All right. Catelyn won't be wondering where we've got to. <laughs> well, that was kind of interesting. I guess that's just kind of a little side thing for flavour, but that, that was kind of interesting. I like that. I, like, I do like the humour of this game so far. It's see, it's been pretty good. Overall, I think. Show he wants to do a commit here, okay. Ah Bay. Ha. Bay.